It's kind of hard to do this stuff here. A little Santa moment here. I just want to do a little shameless self-promotion about some stuff I've got that you might be interested in because a lot of people have come on F since I did this originally. So um, here we go. Let's just check this all out. Okay, so here is my book. Everybody loves me. These are the t-shirts I have available with my beard on them. You could be Santa yourself. Then I have really high quality prints of my artwork. This was an album cover I did for this gentleman. Oh, it's hard to see right here on the right side uh, that he wanted a, a, an album cover of all slaves. So this was that. Anybody who likes a payday candy bar? My seated man. I did all of these in my days as working, doing work as an artist. My Jim Beam bottle. That's how I feel in the morning sometimes. Some of my collage paintings. Got a little Jimi Hendrix in there and Wonder Warthog. These are like almost museum quality prints that we've really done. I did these with the same gentleman, Blue Tremarchi, who I did my book with. Got a little, oh, gotta always have Zappa in these. There's a little more Zappa with Raggedy. There's the mothers, Jimmy Carl Black. So that's all the stuff that's on my site, which is LelandSklarsBeard.com is where you would go to find all this stuff. And there's samples of the, uh, the book in there. And then I have testimonials by people about the book. And I'm going to go ahead and start showing you some of those. Here we have my dear brother, Wadi. Hey, I'm Wadi Wachtel. I'm in a band called The Immediate Family. And I know... I'm not giving any of that family a present. But if you have a family you actually like, you might want to consider this worthless book by my dear brother Leland Sklar. It's got about, I don't know, eight, 9,000 pictures of people uh, sending their love. And it's really uh, hysterically great, and we'd love to have it. Uh, it's called Everybody Loves Me, if you can read. I don't know. I don't know a lot of smart people anymore, but... Uh, check it out. If you want to get a great present for people, go to LelandSklarsBeard.com and uh, order yourself a book. Uh, you may regret it. I know they'll regret it, but Leland will be happy. And none of us uh, get any of the proceeds. So why not? Have a great Christmas and uh, take it easy. <laughs> See you. Love, Wad. Love, Wad. Oh, we have a little... Van Dyke Parks, hold on, let me see right here. Hi, this is Van Dyke Parks, but you probably already know that. You know, a lot of people look at a book like this by the legendary Leland Sklar, Everybody Loves Me, and they go like to the back to see maybe they've been italicized, you know, included. I don't do that. No, no, I'm, I'm way beyond that. I just go to my, my page with the picture that says, Everybody loves me. That's me, Van Dyke Parks. Go to LelandSklarsBeard.com and get the skinny. Nobody quite like Van Dyke, I'll tell you. Here we got LeVar Burton. Hi, I'm LeVar Burton with today's book recommendation. I'm going to recommend Everybody Loves Me by my favorite bass player on the planet, Leland Sklar. This is a book where many people, most of them famous, say hi to Lee in a really singular, friendly way. You're going to love this book. You can run out and get it, or you don't have to run at all. Go to LelandSklarsBeard.com for your copy. That's LelandSklarsBeard.com. But you don't have to take my word.
He's such a great cat. Let me uh, move this over. And here's my brother. Oh, no. We'll just jump, I guess, right to Lyle. Here's Lyle. Love it. Everybody loves Leland Sklar. You know and love Leland Sklar. The, the title of his book would seem to be ironic, but it is not. It is a wonderful example of Leland's self-effacing sense of humor. I first worked with Leland Sklar in 1988 in the recording studio. We've been friends ever since. I was a fan of Leland's uh, way before that, ever since the very first time I heard him on a recording. Um, He's such a humble man, and not really. He, well, he exhibits his humble sense of humor uh, in this book. I, I had to be prompted uh, more than once to uh, salute Leland in this way, uh, but I am so proud to uh, be included in his book. This this picture, my wife April snapped this. Uh, just after my uh, first colonoscopy, which I felt was somehow fitting, and and uh, we sent it to Leland, and he was nice enough to include it in the book. Had to. Everybody Loves Leland Sklar is simply true. If, you're, if you'd like to find your own copy of Everybody Loves Me, go to Leland Sklar's Beard. Dot com. Leland Sklar's Beard, B-E-A-R-D, dot com. Everybody loves you, Leland. That's just true. Okay, here's... Oh, no, this will be... Uh-oh, this is trouble. Okay, so I'm in here in the uh, village recorders, you know, and, you know... What the, what the hell? What are you doing here? Dude, you're late for the session, Lee. Oh, no. We've been making records for 40 years. A lot in this studio. The Village Recorder. Look at this incredible board. God, this is like, it's as sexy as a woman. But anyway, not as sexy as that. Now, Leland, besides being a bad mofo as a bass player, is a bad mofo is an author. He's got this book of everybody giving the finger. And I'm so honored I'm in it too. Because I got a big long finger. You He's got a you. long beard. I got a long finger. I got a big nose, which means you big know. feet. You know. <laughs> anyway, you guys, this book is so badass. There's so many cool pictures. Anybody or anybody, I mean, just filled with like, the middle finger. Jeff Beck. Yeah. Charlie Watts. I mean, come on. This is great. Oh, that's, boy, I nailed a great page. You did. You guys got to check this out. It's a beautiful book. And it's got a beautiful man on the cover. You know, I tell everybody, <laughs> that I tell everybody, you know, I mean, I've had 40 years of recording and played on so many records. But I always go, but Leland's done it 15 years more than that. We, he started at two, and I started at zero. But anyway, this book is badass, and you can get it on Leland's, no, Leland Sklar's Beard dot com. <laughs> and that's Kenny, Kenny Aronoff. Kenny Aronoff. Leland's, Leland's, <laughs> that's Leland you Sklar's <laughs> Beard, Leland Sklar's Beard dot com, right? Thank you, honey. <laughs> What a lunatic. Okay, let's get a little of my brother, Russ. Hello, everybody. This is Russ Kunkel from the Immediate Family. And you know, during this time of the year, we just had Thanksgiving and we had Black Friday and today's Cyber Monday. And I'm thinking about, I got to start thinking about shopping for my friends. And all of a sudden at breakfast this morning, I had this incredible idea. The perfect gift. Lee Sklar's book, Everybody Loves Me. That's what you need to do. That's what I'm going to do. All you have to do is go to leelandsclarsbeard.com. And that's, you can order the book right there. Okay. Happy holidays, everybody. I love Russ. Pull this over. Say goodbye to Russ. 
Who do we got? We got Nico Bolas here, our engineer who did our immediate family album. Plus, he's done a million other things. So I'm going to stretch him out so he's as big as everybody else. Hi, everybody. Uh, Christmas is coming. And um, I was trying to find a really, really good present for people. And uh, I like giving things that are more uh, technical. Um, so uh, many of you know that uh, Southside Johnny, me, a lot of other people are really into birds. Um, and I gave this bird book uh, a few years ago to a lot of my friends and they, they didn't really understand it at all. Uh, they thought I was kind of wacky for giving it to them. And I think most of them wound up in uh, thrift stores. But this year I found a bird book, um, this bird book, Everybody Loves Me. It's about birds, but it's more of a global consciousness and a statement on society and how birds are involved in the lives of people. Uh, and it has birds from around the world. Um, and you can see them in their natural habitats, not in uh, like a zoo-like cage or, or some stuffed museum. These are birds that are actually alive, uh, that are expressive, um, and uh, participate in society. And so I highly recommend this for Christmas. Um, and you can get it at, uh, what's this guy's name? LelandSklarsBeard.com, I think is what the website's called. LelandSklarsBeard.com. Yeah, um, you may want to check it out. LelandSklarsBeard.com. Best bird book you'll ever get. It's really, really concise. Nico's the best. Well, here's a little darling right here. Okie dokie. Hi, I'm Lisa Loeb. And a lot of people have been asking me lately, what have you been reading over the last couple of years? It's been a strange time. Well, I love to read this book, How to Find the Work You Love by Lawrence Bolt. It gives me tools of how to look at my life, how to look at my job. Another one that I've really gone to a lot with my kids home during these COVID times is this one, If the Buddha Had Kids by Charlotte Castle. You know, another book that I love that really has given me a lot in my life, and I think it'll brighten your day too, is this one, Everybody Loves Me by Leland Sklar. He's played bass with me, and I've played my music with him. Look at this. I'm even in the book. Next to Kevin Bacon. That's one degree. Do yourself a favor. Get one of these or more. It's LelandSklarsBeard.com, the website where you can get one. That's right. Leland Sklar, S-K-L-A-R-S, Beard.com. She is just the best. I just love Lisa. And then we go to... Hello there, this is Judith Owen, and I'm sending out a very important public message for all people that like wearing black and leather. Yes, rockers, the world throughout, this is the present that you need this Christmas. None other than Everybody Loves Me, yes, Leland Sklar. If any of you know who he is, and that's obviously who I'm talking to right now, you know that life without Leland is unbearable, so why bother? Instead, get Everybody Loves Me. This is what we're really after. Thousands upon thousands upon thousands of photographs of Leland being given the finger by all of us who love him so desperately. I, it's not that I'm vain or self-absorbed, although I am, of course. Mm -hmm an artist, but I am in this book a lot, an awful lot, but there are so many people, I don't know who they are, but I do recognize many, many, many stars. And I think when it comes to, look at this, giving of the finger, look at that. Oh, there's Maureen, this is Scott. When it comes to this, my dad and my sister are even in it. I mean, there's so many incredible people in here. This is the Christmas present for you. Like I said, if you like black, if you like leather, if you're still living in the, eight, no. This is the present that you need. Take it from me, Judith Owen, one of the few women who have lived to tell the tale of how it is being in this industry, working with the legend that is Leland Scar. Happy Christmas, everyone. She's such a treat. And here's trouble. 
Yeah, let me move him over just a little bit. Ladies and gentlemen, I want to present you with an amazing find. I have never seen a book like this, and neither have you, okay? Leland Sklar, personal friend of mine, has, I, I can't tell you, it's a quantum leap in, in, in a collection of shit, okay? <laughs> And this book is full of shit. And it is great shit. Okay? So, Leland Sklar, personal friend of mine, and I'll give you a hint. Okay? Now, you've got to read the whole book, but you'll love the ending. Okay? So, Joe Walsh here, perfect Christmas gift for your loved ones or somebody you hate. It'll work great for them, too. Leland Sklar. I'll spell it for you. L-E-L-A-N-D-S-K-L-A-R-S. B-E-A-R-D. All one word. Dot com. And com is all one word also. <laughs> this, is, this is it. This will change your life. This will put you... A, a higher level of consciousness and and mojo. So I'm presenting this. Get it. You got to get it. You got to get it. Okay? Take my word for it. Or don't. Get this book. Joe. <laughs> There's nobody like Joe. Oh, here we have Jackson. Jackson Brown here. Uh, I want to tell you about this wonderful document, this unified expression for what's going on in the world today, what's always been going on evidently, <laughs> what's happening politically, ecologically, and philosophically. Open this anywhere. You can read it from the back to the front or the front to the back, and who knows, find yourself in it, find people you know, find many people you don't know but know of. Uh, expressing their unified feeling for what is actually going on now in the world. And how can you get it? You can, <laughs> you can get this by going to lelandsklar.com. No? lelandsklarsbeard.com. Oh, yeah. You can get this by <laughs> sending in to lelandsklarsbeard.com. <laughs> Love Jackson. <laughs> <laughs> this all these were just so much fun to do. Here we go. Oh, let's, let me move Joe over here. Well, let's get down to the real maniac here. Go ahead. Everybody loves me. Ed Begley. by Leland Sklar. Well, not everybody, Leland. <laughs> you got my picture in your book right here, and you failed to obtain a simple document. Is called a model's release. You try to get by with a hand model release because of the finger with different cropping and editorial choice. Nice try. If you want to find out about my lawsuit, go to LelandSklarsBeard.com and find out more about my... I got a good law firm too, Trickham, Dickham, and Duncan. They're going to help me a good deal with this. And I think I'm going to do very well because he's rich as creases, this guy. He's got a lot of dough. I've been to his house in Pasadena. LelandSklarsBeard.com. Find out about the book. It's worth seeing, just for the lawsuit. Ed Bagley, man, what a what a piece of work, man. I love the cat. Okay, let me still keep up. Here we go. Hi, I'm Chris Isaac, and uh, what I'm doing today is uh, it leaves me a little bit upset, um, but I I think it's something I have to do. I'm showing you a book. This is a book by Leland. Um, I first was aware of this book, like a lot of people, the, the brouhaha, the, the talk on the internet, and I thought, well, it can't be as bad as they're saying. Um, I'm as open-minded, I think, as most people, but what I have here in my hand is 
I would say, offensive to most people, uh, filthy, I don't know if I would use that word, degenerate, maybe. Um, I don't know what the idea was behind this book. It's certainly something I wouldn't want to have children around or church people. Um, and yet, I enjoyed it. So if you're that kind of person, check this out. You can go to that website or you can contact your local district attorney or call me, Chris Isaac, because you don't have to call me on a phone line or the internet. I'm actually watching you. That's right, baby. I'm going to go back and look at this book. I don't know why some of these people would even do these things. Or They're real people, though. They're doing it. I mean, it's crazy. He's such a great cat. We had so much fun on the road together. Okay, we're still trying to move Joe out of here. I think that's the only one left. Yeah, that's it. So I'm just going to leave that up. So that's my hustle, everybody. This is my QVC moment here. Um, it's not necessarily just for Christmas. You, this book works. Uh, it's not it, kind of uh, committed to a certain season or anything like that. Um, but I figured, why not? You, all of you are out there, and I should just, you know, come visit you. Um, there's still more to come. Billy Bob Thornton wants to do one, and Lawrence Fishburne said he'll do a video for me. I mean, regardless if they do any book sales, it sure is fun to get together with all these folks and and uh, and get them involved in it because they're all in the book. And uh, we've just had a great time. So I'm going to wish everybody a great week. Instead of music today, I'm just being all completely self-absorbed here and digging me um, and trying to get a whole bunch of crap off to the post office. I got, a, um, I think, uh, 15 books right now. I got to run over to the uh, loading dock and ship off today. So um, all my best wishes, everybody. You take good care. Maybe the book says everybody loves me, but I'll tell you, I love everybody, almost everybody. There's a few out there I'm not co completely uh, enamored with, but all of you who are here, oops, they're calling me right now. I think those are the people that I'm not enamored with. So take good care. I'll be back tomorrow with some music. Bye.